Hello everyone to another video about SAF Laser. Let's discuss how to create a fully custom login page in SAF Laser UI. So starting on 21.2, we can create a SAF Laser application template, but we can also use this method here. So we can create our own Razor component and add a add page with some route and then basically just add that route on the login path. That's pretty simple, right? So let's see it in action. And of course, we have to process the login, and you can see here we can get the authentication standard login parameters, and from there we take the username, the password, and we log on, and so on. So let's see it in action. So I have this project here, custom login page demo, and if you see in our startup, we are using my login page. If we go to the custom login components that have that Add page directive is the my login page, and right here we only add in a custom login and we're reusing what SAF provide to us. So let's run it and see what is happening. Let's give it a second. So if you see here, we have our H1 tag custom login, and we have our actual control from DevExpress, the same SAF login screen. So this means that right here, we can put any markup, any CSS, and we can customize this login really well. And actually, if we do the inspect, we can also get the CSS selectors, and we can start messing it without having to do anything. But this is a way to go more in depth on that uh, route. Now, if we stop this, I want to change this route on the login path, and we're gonna use this login page racer. So what are we doing here? So if we go to the login page racer component, we have our route here, and then you see that we have a lot of different HTML here. We have a more involved, we are bringing JavaScript, we are bringing a few more things, and we're calling this component type login component. If we go to login component, so right here, we have the form, and then we're gonna have the the H2, and we're gonna have an input for the username and input for the password. We're gonna have the button to submit, and then we're gonna call the process login as we were showing. And in the process login, we're gonna take the authentication standard login parameter, so on, so on. So basically, we're gonna do everything, but look how different the UI will show. And this is a really simple example. We have seen Safers done amazing visualization with the login screen, with making the login to the left putting the login to the right. Right here is just a simple one, but I believe that it looks really nice. So, admin, voila. Pretty neat, right? Okay, that's all for this video. See you in the next one.